Assalamu alaikum. alaykum. I'm talking in English because I really want that this should reach to the people who really matter. I'm going to talk about Ukraine-Russian war. I'm not going to make any political analysis. What I'm going to say is that humans have reached here after billions of years of effort and investment of the nature on human consciousness. And now at this time, humans are capable of controlling the earth, controlling the space, and they have become master of the resources of this planet. So the whole of this investment will be wasted if we just start fighting with each other on the basis of our ugly ego and our personal anger. Now, what is happening in Russia and Ukraine? I really don't know the political reason of it completely. But what I can foresee is that if this matter escalates further and if Russia persists like this and then Europe and NATO forces started helping Ukraine and then there is a large scale war and nowadays there is no need for a large scale war in a term of months of troops occupying the areas. Now it's a matter of few seconds to actually destroy a large part of a country. And God forbid if this happens, you can imagine what will happen to this planet. And that means just because of ego of few people, because all the people who will be victims, those who are dying, those who are becoming homeless, those children who are becoming orphans and those ladies who are becoming widows, they have nothing to do with this politics. The people on the top, in the end, they will shake hand and they will join on a dining table. But what will happen to millions of those people and if it actually goes in a world war fashion? And then there are more chances of it if this conflict continues for some time. So I am nobody. I am just a surgeon living in Pakistan, but I am part of the whole universe as a as, as, as one of the consciousness which is part of the whole universe. I am one of the member of a great community called humanity. And for that, for God's sake, I want to just urge to all those who can control it, that please sort out these matters on the table. There may be certain conflicts, there may be different point of views, but fighting and killing and destroying the property, people and this beautiful planet is very, very dangerous and very, very ugly. I don't know whether this will reach to the people, you know, who matter, but I wish that we have at least this much consciousness, at least this much common sense that this is not the solution. And ultimately, it is just like cutting my own hand. Because this hand is different from this hand. So this hand presumes that if I'll cut this hand, I will have a super messy. But actually, if this will bleed, if this is going to affect this hand as well. All humans are like one body. So if, for example, there is a boil on the leg, then eyes has to cry. If there is any infection, then whole body has to become feverish. So that is what is going to happen. And nowadays, in the time of... Uh, this economic globalization, suddenly you will see that if this war continues, living in those areas where there is no war will become difficult for the people. There will be rise in petrol, petrol prices, there will be rise in uh, you know, prices of the common food items and uh, this thing will carry on. So please, for God's sake, all those who can sort it out, please sit around a table and sort it out. Please have mercy on this planet which has got a potential to become heaven but we have decided to make it a hell. At least billions of people living on this planet don't deserve that. And for those who have got authority, who have got power, it is their responsibility to really convert this hell-like situation into a heavenly environment. Thank you.